So let's compete in the bug catching contest! Today's Tuesday. That means the bug catching contest is on today. The rules are simple. Using one of your Pokémon, catch a bug Pokémon to be judged. Would you like to give it a try? Let's do it! Uh-oh. You have more than one Pokémon. You'll have to use Nidorino, the first Pokémon in your party. Is that okay with you? Yes. Fine, we'll hold on- we'll hold your other Pokémon while you compete. Chris's Pokémon were left with the contest helper. Here are the Park Balls for the contest. We get 20 Park Balls. The person who gets the strongest bug Pokémon is the winner. You have 20 minutes. If you run out of Pokéball- if you- excuse me, if you run out of Park Balls, you're done. You can keep the last Pokémon you catch as your own. Go out and catch the strongest bug Pokémon you can find. So now we're here in the bug catching contest. This is a very good opportunity to catch a good pug, bug Pokémon if you want to look for one. But there are only four Pokémon that you definitely want to catch if you want to win. And they just happen to have a 4% encounter rate, so trying to find either one of these would take a couple tries. At most. Oh, well! Our second encounter, we run into a Scyther! Well, this is one of those Pokémon that has that 4% encounter rate. And definitely one of the Pokémon you want to catch if you want to win. I'm, I'm definitely going to want to go with Scyther! Whoa! Looks like I don't want to really do Horn Attack. I mean, at least I weakened it, but I don't want to go too far. I mean, because... I want this neat I want this Scyther to stay here. Uh, of course I had to miss tackle. Of course. Yikes. Uh I wanna weaken it even more, you know, to to red health, but let's see. I don't wanna risk double kick. Uh, let's do poison sting since it's weak. Hoping it doesn't poison it. Okay. Ah it poisoned it! No! Ah man. That sucked. That sucked. I mean, sure, I got easy experience, but now I gotta try to find another one. Oh, well. The encounter right after the Paris. We run into yet another Scyther. <laughs> okay. No problem. No problem at all. Okay, so I'm hoping that I don't... Maybe I should not use Poison Sting, because I... Of course I don't want it to risk getting poisoned. Okay, perfect. Red health. Just where I wear... Just right where I want it to be. Let's bust out the park balls. <laughs> nice, nice color it decides to give the park balls. Uh, it didn't even shake once. You know, it'd be a bit better if I had, uh... If I had Bellsprout so I could put it to sleep. Two, three! Ah! Man! Here we go again. Oh boy, the Leer attacks. This is gonna really lower Nidorino's defense big time. Ah! Come on, catch it. Ah! Come on! This is. Oh, focus energy. Oh boy. Focus energy plus a couple Leers. That could be bad. That could be bad. Oh, come on, catch it already. Ah! I'm trying to not panic too much over this, because, you know, it did a couple leers on me and now it's using... Well, it did use focus energy, but it wasted it on trying to do another leer. One. Uh... But Scyther's really been the bug Pokemon I've always wanted to go for during these bug catching contests. It's gotten me victories, and this is, of course, definitely one of the Pokemon you want to go for in catching it. Three! There we go! Got her. Got ourselves a Scyther! 4'11", 123 pounds. Heh! Look at that, it's number 123 in the Pokedex and it weighs 123 pounds. <laughs> it's very proud of its speed. It moves so fast that its opponent does not even know what knocked it down. <laughs> Pretty good description. Caught a Scyther! So now, we don't even have to wait until the 20 minutes are up. Once we caught our Pokémon, we can just talk to... Uh, the contest helper. You still have 17 minutes left. Do you want to finish now? Yes! Okay, please wait here for the announcement of the winners. Alright, here we go! We will now judge the Pokémon you've caught. So many dots. 
We have chosen the winners. Are you ready for this? Drum roll, please. There we go. Placing third was me! Who caught a Scyther? The score was 323 points. Placing second was Poke Van William. We fought him. Who caught a Butterfree? Now that's a... That's another good Pokemon to catch for a winner. 328 points. This bug catching contest winner is... Bugcatcher Josh, who caught a... Scyther! Well... The winning score was 333 points. Oh, well... That's what we get when we finish in third place. We get a gold berry. But come on. I mean, that was... Well, I mean, I'll, I'll admit. That was a pretty... I mean, at least the other... Other contestants caught good Pokemon themselves. Maybe my, maybe my Scyther was a bit of a low level. So that's what a gold berry is. Please join us for the next contest. We'll return the Pokemon we kept for you. Here you go. And of course, uh, whenever we get done with the contest... We can keep the uh, Pokemon that we caught. But I'm not going to take a third place lying down. I'm going to try again and come out with a victory. Alright. So I went ahead and caught me yet another Scyther. But this time it's a level 14 Scyther. Alright. We will now judge the Pokemon you've caught. Da -da 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 we have chosen the winners. Drum roll please. Unfortunately, those aren't actual drums. It's me knocking, it's me, uh, you know, knocking my hands on my desk. But hey, it works too. Are you ready for this? Placing third was Bugcatcher Benny, who caught a Weedle. The score was 297 points. Placing second was Camper Barry, who caught a Venonat. The score was 329 points. This bug catching contest winner is... Chris, who caught a Scyther! First place, baby! Oh, yeah! The winning score was 339 points. Chris, the number one finisher, wins a Sunstone. So a Sunstone is like the, uh, you know, like the Leaf Stone, Water Stone. And, uh, but Sunstone was actually debuted in Gold, Silver, and Crystal. So we got the Sunstone. That is the uh, first place uh, item we get for a bug catching contest. Second place will give us an Everstone. And third place, of course, was the Gold Berry. So everyone who didn't make the uh, top three will just get our standard berry. Please join us for the next contest. We will return the Pokemon we kept for you. Here you go. Give anything to the sites or you, you received? No. And there you have it. There is the bug catching contest. Today's contest is over. We hope you will participate in the future. So I'll go ahead and talk to these other guys, just for the heck of it. Wow, you beat me. You're pretty good. Why, thank you. I envy you. I just couldn't do it this time. <laughs> that Pokemon you caught. It's awesome. I know, right? Scyther is a badass bug type. Congrats. You have earned my respect. See? That's what it's all about right there. Respect. I... I can't believe I lost that bug catching. Huh, how convenient. I think all five of these uh, were bug catchers. So, I outcaught bug Pokemon at the bug catcher's own game. <laughs> uh, let's see. I may as well go ahead and have all of them facing in the same direction. And I'll be standing in the middle, right outside the reception desk. Because I am the winner. And I will exit with a win. I mean, besides, bug catching contests can be pretty irritating sometimes, because it takes you quite a couple tries to find the uh, rarest Pokemon, which in the bug catching contest, the rarest Pokemon to find are Butterfreeze, Beedrills, Pincers, and Scythers. Those are the Pokemon you're definitely going to want to go for if you want to win the bug catching contest. And sometimes other Pokemon can depend on, you know, certain levels you can find, because that's how the judging is uh, scored based on the rarity of the Pokemon and what level it is. So I think if I remember correctly, I think I lost the bug catching contest with a... I'm not, I can't really be positive if it was a level 13 or a level 14 Scyther. Because that's the only level that you can find the Scythers here. Not to mention, this is the only place... The only time you can find Scythers and Pincers are during the bug catching contest here in the National Park. But anyway, those are the only two levels that Scyther and Pincers can be found at level 13 and 14. And if I remember correctly, I lost to a Paris, which, 
uh, Paris and Venonat are the second rarest at 8% encounter rate, but they can be at higher levels, like at level 15 and 16. And that's probably how I lost, because of the uh, increased level, and since it's the second rare, those are the second rarest Pokemon you can find. So it's pretty ridiculous how a Scyther can lose to a Paris, just because of the difference in levels, but I was really disappointed about that. But hey, at least I won this one, right? <laughs> So, and with since I got the win, I'm going to exit with a win. Because that's how I like it, like that.